This laboratory processes samples for wastewater, drinking water, non-potable, surface water, lakes, stormwater ponds, electric discharge water. Hi, my name is Katherine Bray and I'm a manager of water quality here with the city of Tallahassee. Our purpose is we support the compliance and operational businesses for the city of Tallahassee and their utility. That includes the wastewater treatment plant, the drinking water system, and uh, the electric and stormwater departments. We've had some sort of laboratory with the city of Tallahassee for over 50 years, starting in the 70s, primarily for the wastewater treatment plant support. There was a little bench laboratory that, that just ran a few simple analyses. And over the years, um, with one of the expansions in the late 70s, they built the first water quality lab to support the needs of the wastewater operations and the drinking water operations. And from there, the lab expanded several times. And just recently, of course, we moved out of that old lab that um, had been functioning for over 40, 50 years. And now we're in our brand new lab, which is 8,000 square foot facility from a 5,000 square foot facility. Well, in this beautiful building, we have 14 people. We actually, for the analysis, we have nine analysts, chemists and biologists. Hi, my name is Vivian Soriel. I'm the supervisor here at the Water Quality Lab for the City of Tallahassee. Oh, it varies from day to day. That's what's exciting. We have various projects that come at different times. Uh, the, basically, the process is we have samples that come in. So from the moment a sample walks in the door, we track it, we receive it, and we analyze it. Then we enter the data. The data is reviewed. It's reviewed another time before it's sent to the water quality manager to send the reports to the customers. Well, we have six areas here in the laboratory. We have the physical area that tests for pH, conductivity, uh, alkalinity, fluoride, uh, various physical properties of the samples. Then we have a metals uh, lab that checks for various metals that might be in the water or uh, in the treatment plant water. Then we have a semi-volatile organic lab. We have a volatile organic lab. We have a microbiology lab. And we have a nutrients lab. And each one has their own specific analysis that they conduct on our samples. Annually, we get about eight to 10,000 samples. Uh, we do over 300 analytes on the samples. So as you can see, we have a very talented team here uh, that can do all of these analysis on conduct all of them. Most of our customers are from the city of Tallahassee, but we also support communities that don't have their own labs. During hurricanes and so forth, if I, some labs that might be shut down, we are here all the time, six days a week for sure. Uh, if we need to be here seven days, we are here seven days. So we're always open, we're, we're always running samples. We pull water from 27 water supply wells throughout Tallahassee, and the water, we have minimal treatment that's needed to that water, and then it's put directly into the distribution system, including into those elevated water tanks that you see throughout town and those provide pressure to then deliver the water to your homes and buildings throughout the town. We sample daily, monthly, quarterly, throughout the year to make sure that the water that we provide is safe and meets all compliance standards. Also provide support for the operations of the wastewater treatment plant and every, every aspect of that process to make sure that that is operating to the standards that they expect. As far as stormwater, we have a program that we process the samples for lakes in the area and stormwater ponds so that we can be assured that the engineering practices that we put in place and the design standards for stormwater ponds are doing what they're designed to do, to clean up the water before it makes its way downstream to the lake. To learn more about your water quality, you can visit talgov.com slash water quality and on that webpage there's lots of tips and tricks for homeowners to help improve the water quality in their home. 
you also have a link to the yearly water quality report that we publish that provides the data for water quality.